Hey fuckers, welcome back to another episode. In today's video, we will be discussing the Type 5 mods that you can pick up from Amazon right now to transform your stock G35 from this to this. Okay, maybe not quite like that, but very close. I have not done an Amazon video in a long time, so it's overdue. Let's give you guys an updated list. We're gonna go ahead and get started. I would just appreciate if you guys can give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you guys wanna see more of this content, and all the links will be down in the description down below. Without further ado, let's begin this list. Everybody knows that lighting changes, transform anything. If you have a house that's dim, add some lights to it, it's gonna make the house look a lot better. Same thing with cars. Taking that in mind, our first mod on this list are are sequential side markers. Honestly guys though, but one of the things this mod caught my attention because if you look on the description here on Amazon, you see that yellow car? That was the OG B distinct automatic G35 back in the old days. I'm not sure how it ended up on Amazon for this item, but that's the car and I've never had that side marker ever in my life. So I don't even know how they put it in that picture. I, I have no clue. But regardless, the side markers look really good. I have a different style side marker, but mine's I just wanted a black look because my cables don't even work so I can't even install it But for you guys who have working side markers go ahead and get those sequentials They will make it look so much better and will go in coordination with your car So when you put emergency lights, it'll blink that wherever you it's only $43 So it's not too expensive and that one goes good in pair with our number two mod on this list Like the headlights you can go ahead and cop those on Amazon for around 380 bucks to 400 bucks you guys can take a look. It has an LED strip that looks freaking sick, which it makes the G35 look super modern. And if you have your turn signals or your emergency, you can see that it has sequential lighting too, which is why I highly recommend this to go and pair with the side markers. So the side markers go in sequential with your headlights and you have a nice LED package right there. These headlights are a little bit expensive, 400 bucks, but they're totally worth it. Mod number three on this list to transform your front end a little bit more is gonna be a front lip for your OEM bumper. Of course, since then I've upgraded to a Karuma Z front bumper with a front splitter, but I did rock that front lip for the OEM bumper for a very long time. And if you guys don't believe me, let's go ahead and get a recap of that Amazon picture of the orange G35 back in the old days. You guys can see in that Amazon picture, I had that black front lip right then and there. When you add the front lip to your OEM bumper, it makes the car look a little bit lower than it, what it actually is. And and it makes the car look really really good so which is one of the reasons why i really recommend the front lip it only costs 73 bucks much more less expensive than like a front splitter or a new bumper and it'll make your oem bumper look like an aftermarket bumper you can paint match it or you can do it black like i did and it looks really really good cool now we showed a lot of love to the front end we got new headlights new sequential side markers and a new front lip for the front bumper now this is stock height but what if you can go from this to this? Check it out, brand new look, right? Looks a lot better. New angle, check that out. Now don't let me completely fool you. These, uh, I I'm on bags, I'm on bags, which is why it's really low. But point is, when you lower your car, your car looks better, period. That's that's what it is. So that will lead us to mod number four, a nice pair of coilovers for your car will make your G look a lot better. I went ahead and recommended the True Hearts back in when I ordered them back in 2018. They were $500, as you you guys know everything around the world is getting a lot more expensive so now the true hearts are about six hundred and thirty dollars as you can see here on the Amazon link so they got a little bit more expensive but they're still the budget version and and they're good they're great nice pair of coils and they did me really really good on that same orange car that's in the picture now your G is looking kind of fire it's lowered it's looking good stance you got new headlights you got new sequential side markers It's looking really really good you got that fresh new front lip in the front now there's only one thing missing if it's a stock g35 most likely you have the stock exhaust and everybody wants to hear their g35 rumble at least a little bit so there's a lot of exhaust out there there's a z1 exhaust tome exhaust and different type of good exhaust but for the sake of keeping this amazon related i went ahead and added an amazon exhaust i went ahead and included right here the rev 9 catback exhaust it's 400 dollars for a catback 400 dollars for that dude you really can't beat it it's literally a bolt-on mod you just gotta unbolt everything in your stock exhaust according to the reviews it sounds good and here's a little small little clip
This Rev9 exhaust is not too loud, but it's loud enough compared to the OEM to where you can hear it and hear your G35 roar a little bit more. If you guys have a Rev9 exhaust, go ahead, comment down below how you guys like your Rev9 exhaust. Let everybody know, give them some feedback. And if it's not that good, let them down in the comment section below so we can go ahead and take that off the list. Talking about Amazon, there's an Amazon Prime trip. That will conclude today's top five mods from Amazon to transform your stock G35. Let me know what mods you guys think I missed. Put them down in the comment section below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. This Saturday, we are going to be going to a dealer, hint, hint. So stay tuned for that video. I'm super excited to show you guys. I'll catch you guys next episode. Peace out, fuckers.